Daniel, this isn't like the advertising agencies you're used to dealing with. The medicines that my team supports are at different stages in their product life cycle and deal with many different topics. What do you mean? For example, some are direct studies about the prices customers would be willing to pay for a new diabetes drug. Some are secondary studies, meaning a generic report on the diabetes market that we pay for. In fact, for those secondary studies, one company has a monopoly. So forget about trying to generate competition. I see. I'm sure there are opportunities, though. Could you give me a breakdown of spend by the type of market research? <sighs> Daniel, my team works as individuals on programs defined by different products marketing teams. So my spend is just all these individual spends added together. So giving you a breakdown of spend across all these individuals won't tell us anything important. Hmm. Looks like the market research department could use better structure. I mean, how could we increase control of market research spend if each individual is just doing what individual product marketing teams ask them to do? So,、uh, what would you do if your budget was cut? Do you know something I don't? 